by three degrees, turn complete, sir. Come in, second one. We have a radar trace, sir. We have a radar trace, sir. Uh, bearing 147, speed Mach 5, reducing fast. Mr. Kubom. Sir? Do you see anything? No, sir. Yes. Yes, there. What is it, sir? I don't know. I've never seen anything like this before. It's coming down. Action stations. And everybody. Now, this is why you've asked me down here. I can tell you there'll be an official denial in tomorrow's editions. Yes, I expected that. I stress the word official. Apparently, it was a test flight of one of the Navy's prototype aircraft. Unfortunate. Yes. Mm. Stiger, you're getting too suspicious. It's almost a complex. Well, is that bad? Look at that photograph. It could be anything. Yes, including a UFO. There was an immediate inquiry. I was in touch with the Naval Board personally. They were satisfied. It's a false alarm. General, are you warning me off? No, I am not warning you off, even if it sounds like it. How many so-called sightings have turned out to be aircraft? But this was a highly trained naval crew on a ship equipped with every modern detection device. Let's have some breakfast. And it wasn't like that. It happened too fast. And the wreckage sank with no attempt at salvage. The ocean is too deep at that point. Well, I take it you've no objections if I conduct my own investigations? No, <laughs> none at all. But don't expect any cooperation from the naval authorities. They've accepted the findings. Mm. You have uh, 
Check the records for that day, I take it? Yes. And? Well, there were no UFO sightings, if that's what you mean. None got through, huh? No, none that we know of. But they have before. Not for a long time. Since your defense tightening, in fact. General, please don't underestimate their intelligence. It has always only been a matter of time before they discovered a way to pierce our screen. Toast? No, thank you. What's the latest on Watchdog? No change. UFO still in the stationary position and showing no sign of moving, sir. What the blazes are they waiting for? Well, Colonel, what does the computer think? Well, the Senate information is reluctant to give an answer. But when I insisted, it said they're either waiting for A, reinforcements, B, bad weather to negate radar, or C, long operations of defenses, namely shadow control. Well, we know there are no signs of reinforcements, and the weather forecast for the next month is excellent, and shadows certainly won't cease operations. I suggest the next batch of information you feed in, you add a drop of castor oil. Depth 600. <laughs> 620. Maximum safe depth. Six forty, Colonel. We are. I heard you the first time, Captain. Continue the dive. Six eighty. Seven fifty. Pressure malfunction. Level. Level out. Yes? Turbine's not responding, sir. 820. Engine's overheating. Hold full power. Forward plates are buckling. Turbine's still not responding, sir. Hold power. We'll burn out, sir. Hold full power. 880. Steady at 900. Maintaining level course, Captain. Take her back to 600. Up to 600. Zona. Colonel. Find anything? No, Colonel. Nothing? How much water below us? 200 fathoms, Colonel. Thanks. We could try again. No. No, it's too deep. Thank you, Captain. Yes, sir. Radar reports increased aerial activity. Oh. Tracer.
bridge. We've picked up a radar trace bearing 281. Mac 5, reducing. Action stations. Gun crews on immediate standby. Repeat. Gun crews on standby. Missile in position, sir. Launch missile, Mr. Cooper. Clear for firing. Clear for firing. Get that missile launched, Mr. Cooper. Bridge to missile control. Fire, repeat, fire. It's the damage officer, sir. Missile guidance electronics have been affected by the explosion. They're still trying to ascertain the damage. No use, sir. Missile systems are negative. Alert gun crews. Bridge to gun, stand by. Bridge to gun, stand by. There it is. Sit out of range, sir. 